Seconds out, seconds out. Val Vincent, we're back. We're back at it. Second and round. Kelly's jumping right in there with that right. And She's been connecting those solid rights, and they've been having their effect. Uh, Teresa going down in that first round. Yep. You know what? It was a scary situation for Teresa just now, Vincent. But it seems like she's, for the most part, recovered. But I, what I'm seeing is she's kind of planted. She kind of planted yeah. there. You know, yeah. she's giving some jabs. She's going to need to exercise a lot more movement. Yeah. She's going to come up against such a younger, more energetic, vibrant opponent such as Kelly. Kelly goes down to the body. Kelly doing her best. Teresa yeah. Steele, she's planted there. She's not moving around like she should be. Oh, good. Overhand left by Teresa. Kelly seems quick to come out of the, the breaks punching. I see as uh, a yes, tactic. Yes, yes, absolutely. Good bob and weave. But she, she's still struggling a bit. Teresa still the struggling angles. a bit. She's I getting she good angles. It. Teresa trying to clinch. She's in a bit of trouble. Good left. Two good, followed by another good left to the upper body in the face of Kelly. Veteran referee breaking it up, letting them reset. Teresa having a very difficult time right now. Just in comparison to her last couple of fights, she hasn't had this level of difficulty with an opponent since then. And maybe it might beg the question, is it too early for her to have entered into the ring or too late? Depending which point of view you want to take. Well, I'll tell you one thing. She's a fighter, and she she doesn't know how to back down. And that's a good, good straight straight down the pipes. And Teresa's down for the second time. And Kelly's is delivering blows straight down the pipe. Those punches don't take no directions. They just go straight. And they're landing right on that face of Teresa. And uh, they're starting to take their toe. Kelly looking to be in good shape. Saved by the bell there. Just want to thank all our sponsors, Rubis, Gatorade, Carib, Lindos, and I will see you after we get back from these breaks. 